Okay, welcome back. Uh, we are now going to dive into a real quick test just to validate the configuration we set up before to make sure the VLANs that should talk to each other can and to make sure that the segments of the network that should not be able to talk cannot. So a couple provisos to this. Pinging does not necessarily indicate whether you have access to a endpoint or not. That's a different type of traffic. So typically you're dealing with TCP or UDP traffic and ping is specifically ICMP traffic. So it's a little different type of traffic. We've opened up these rules using protocol any specifically so that we do get valid ping tests through or blocking uh, to exemplify that. So with that, let's take a quick look. Here is our current state PFSense and I have two virtual machines. One is sitting on the LAN interface and one is sitting on the DMZ interface. So if you recall how we configured that, the LAN has access to everything. The server network, which we'll infer some testing on that, uh, has access to itself and the DMZ and the internet. And the DMZ has access to the internet only. And, and then there, there is one gotcha there, which is intentional, and I'll show you that as we step through it. So let's dive in. Let's go ahead and start with the LAN virtual machine. So we should be able to ping out to the internet, and we can. We should be able to ping to the server's network, and we can. And we should be able to ping to the DMZ network as well. Give it the actual host that's living in there. There it is. And we can. That's good. Let's flip over to the test VM that sits on the DMZ. So this should be able to ping out to the internet, and it can. Good. Should not be able to ping to the LAN, and it cannot. That's good. And it should not be able to ping the server network. It cannot. It should be able to ping its own gateway, the DMZ interface, just dot 20, and it can. And I mentioned that there's one gotcha. So the way we set up that rule, it is doing a block rule on any traffic trying to get to the LAN. It's doing a block rule on any traffic trying to get to the server's VLAN. And it's doing an allow for anything else. So in our configuration, that should only be the anything else should be out the WAN to the internet. Well, since this is a lab, the anything else also includes my actual physical network beyond the virtualized network here. So I can ping my real physical LAN. Ah, okay. So that's a gotcha there. And let's just take a quick look at that rule. There's of course ways around this, but it's good to show these things so you understand how the traffic flows. So over on the DMZ side, again, we're blocking traffic to the servers VLAN, traffic to the LAN, and anything else can go through. Well, again, anything else also includes my physical LAN outside of the virtual lab. So anyway, this validates that what we set up is operating as intended, and we're gonna to continue to build on this in the next session. We're going to step next into something a little more interesting, which will be issuing Let's Encrypt certificates directly to the PFSense firewall. So stay tuned for that coming up soon. Thanks for watching.